Okay. Hello, everybody. Hello, hello. Let's see if I can see you guys. Hello, hello. It is five o'clock, people. Five o'clock. My time. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. I have FaceTime. I have Facebook and I have love for one another. So I got both angles covered and this is not working. Okay. So welcome, everybody. It's five o'clock, as I said, from yesterday's agreement. Thank you so much for tonight's, um, for joining me for tonight's announcement of the next Love For campaign. I'm gonna give it a little, couple more minutes to get people on here, because I know it takes a minute. Technical difficulties like I did. <laughs> Just waiting, waiting, waiting for everybody. I see 11, 39 eyeballs. And you know what, please share this. Um, I hope I have it so it's enabled so that you guys can share this. But um, I wanted to wait a little bit to get more people on to the thing. But of course this is recorded. A lot of people on Facebook. Awesome, awesome. You guys also jump over to Instagram, L4OA Charities also has an Instagram so we can, uh, you know, hit all angles. I gotta, get, I gotta get TikTok, I gotta do that. Anyways. So, so many things to do. Anyways, thank you so much for joining me for tonight's announcement of the Let Next Love For campaign. To recap, in January, we launched our first campaign, Love For Learning, which was, which was, I'm sorry, this is so bad. Sorry, I'm so bad at reading things, but yes. Um, to recap, in January, we launched our first campaign, Love For Warning, which was acknowledged through the work of our recipient, Hannah Ledgerwood. In February, we launched our second campaign, Love for Healthcare Workers. Last night, we awarded the nominee, Teresa Teresa de Amico of New York. Tonight, we move on to our third campaign. In recognition of International Women's Day, which is tomorrow, we are launching our Love for Courageous Women campaign. So, in submissions, everybody listen, in submissions for this campaign, we are looking for mothers, daughters, sisters, friends, aunts, grandmothers, godmothers, any woman who, was went, who has went an extra mile for others, okay? This extra mile can be applied to work, motherhood, career, sports, military, or any number of things where we have seen women consistently display the strength and courage of womanhood, okay? We know that this is a daily endeavor for most women, Yes, <laughs> it's definitely a daily endeavor. Um, but, and we know that each of the submissions will, will demonstrate extraordinary stories of these extraordinary people in our lives. I'm looking forward to reading this. This is gonna be amazing. So I wanna add that this isn't a contest of choosing a winner because we already know that each of the nominees are already winners. Cause we are, that's it. That's just that's who we are. <laughs> the winner of the campaign is more about taking the time to recognize and show love and appreciation for those women that continually provide love, care, nurturing, sacrifice, education, protection, and betterment of our lives, in our lives. Okay, we anticipate a sizable response. You guys all think, I know, I know many of you can think of many things and people, women that you can think of to nominate, so I'm looking forward to it. But we anticipate a sizable response for this campaign, so please submit sooner than later. The ca this campaign will run from today, March 7th, through 3 p.m. April 5th. Okay, so we have to April 5th, 3 p.m. And the recipient of our $1,000 Love for Courageous Women campaign will be announced on April 6th at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Okay, April 6th, you have till today, till March, uh, April 5th, and then I announce it on April 6th at 5, at 5 p.m. Okay, we're looking forward to hearing about the courageous women in your life and looking forward to awarding $1,000 to a nominee. Yay! Okay, so our Love, campaign, love for Campaign I'm sorry, our Love for Courage Women campaign is our way of saying thank you and acknowledging what it takes to be you. All right, please send your submissions to info 
at l4oa.org. We will also post information on all our social, social sites. Say that fast, social sites. <laughs> all right, so get to uh, nominating, think about it, make the story as, um, as thorough as you can. I mean, you know, of course, the more detailed it is, the better, because then we can, you know, see it and feel it, because it's about feeling it as well, all right? We're excited. We're so excited to hear from you all, and I will be checking in with you soon. Okay, until then, love for one another, everybody. Have a great week. Stay safe, strong, and uh, much love. Okay, if you have any questions, go ahead and post on the sites. You can also ask me on the, on the post. I'm going to put the post here so you guys can ask, ask questions and stuff like that. And if you have any other questions, info at l4a.org. All right? Bye, everybody.